Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. He's the number one producer who boasts 10 number one films, including box office smashes like Ride Along, Think Like a Man, and recently, Night School. And he's a comedian and radio and television personality who made his mark on the Steve Harvey Morning Show. Now the two are teaming up for a new reality series on OWN called Ready to Love. Take a look. You gotta show me. I am a African-American woman in a predominantly black city with 20 women to one men. All that's about to change. We're bringing 20 single people together to find something real. You gotta show me. I wanna be like Oprah. You get a man and you get a man. Please welcome Will Packer <laughs> and Nephew Tom. Hey! <laughs> to have you back down to the circle. It's yes, almost it. like you're just a, an honorary brother. As long as y'all keep letting me come, it's the, the sisters and the brother circle. That's yes, right. it is. Yes, I right. will come as long as you let me. Yeah, and now, speaking of sisters, yes. our good girlfriend and sister, Rashawn Ali, was yes. down to the yes. homecoming with you at FAMU. Oh, boy. Yes. Now, <laughs> she wasn't just down at the well, homecoming. See, the, the people say it. That she wasn't just down no, to the no, homecoming. She wasn't just down. And she tried to show us some nice little clean video. But I was thinking that you probably got the real stuff. You know, I got some real stuff. You know, I got some good stuff. <laughs> well, really I got popping. some good stuff. Uh, so we had a pool party. Uh -oh. yes. It was a big pool party. Okay. Now, the black people pool party. So okay. you know, it was about, about 500 swim. people around the pool. Right. <laughs> it was one brave sister in the pool. So she one all sister the that said, I'm going to live my best life. Right. We didn't see her no more that weekend because that hair was done. Yeah, that's all. <laughs> that was it. Over. So everybody else was around the pool. Rashawn was on the edge of the pool doing all the old dances that we used to do right. that none of us can do no more because <laughs> at our age we shouldn't be trying to do right. it. Rashawn was down to live her best life. Yes, Rashawn yes. really likes to live her best life down to she the family. She was turned up all yeah. the way. She gets that's involved. That's my girl. I love it. That's why I love her. Yes. We had a great time, though. It looked like it. Yeah, it was a good time. It, it was a good time. <laughs> yes. Nephew Tommy. Mm. Uh-oh. You're living your best life right about here. Man. Okay? You've done everything. A stand-up comedy, acting, hosting, radio. How have you walked that line between balance and still being so busy? Ooh, mm. it's hard. It's hard. You're balancing family, you're balancing the kids, you're balancing radio, um, this. So, uh, a lot of vitamins. Yeah. <laughs> Two okay. hours of sleep every, okay. every six hours. I'm trying to maintain, but I'm getting through it. I'm excited. This this is exciting right here. I'm I'm um I'm living my best life. I'm on the couch. Yeah, there you go. Definitely. I'm next to Will Packer. We're in the circle. It looks happy to be here. And we in the circle. We in the circle, yeah. brother. And we underneath the Oprah Winfrey umbrella. You can't ask me more. We're gonna receive that. There you go. We're gonna it. go ahead yeah. to receive that. Now, Will, you have done so much in the big screen, so much on the yeah. big screen in, in film. Now you're taking it to the small screen. Why is it important to make this transition at this point in your career? You know what? For me, I want to be producing content wherever my audience is consuming content. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I have to have a company that can um, create content across all facets and across all mediums. Right. Mm -hmm. So I actually have a production deal with Oprah Winfrey's network. Oh, look at that. And so we're going to be producing content for them. And this is our first show mm -hmm. as a part of this partnership. Mm -hmm. nice. And I wanted to do a dating show because I made that show, I made the movie Think Like a Man, mm -hmm. which Tommy had a cameo in. Of right, course, right. it's based on Steve Harvey's <laughs> book. And it was all about men's perspective in dating. Right. And I thought, we need a dating show mm -hmm. that allows women to see what the men say when y'all aren't around. Right. Mm -hmm. And we chose Atlanta because it's a market that people tell me you can't find love in Atlanta. Mm -hmm. I've heard a lot of people say they this is a difficult that. market mm -hmm. because the ratio is kind of out of whack. It's a lot more single women than they are single men. I said, if we can find some men in Atlanta that are actually really to set, ready to settle down. Mm -hmm. We take them, give them to Tommy. Yes. He has real conversations with them, unfiltered. Mm -hmm. When the women aren't around, what do you really think? He mm -hmm. really delves deep and peels back the layers of all the stuff with people trying to pretend and be right. superficial. Mm -hmm. If we get into the real conversation, mm -hmm. I bet women would find that interesting. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's why this show is a little different. You all have been on the road promoting Ready for Love um, for a while now. Now, what is it that you have learned about each other that you did not know? <laughs> No, before you started My buddy Tom, he was, he was nephew Tommy. Okay. But as the show got going and became more successful, he became Thomas. He became Tom. Oh, yes. Very distinguished. Then, okay. then as it kept going, and uh, he started wearing less and less socks. When you, <laughs> when you feel strong enough to let your ankles come out, that's a level of success. Exactly. That's how you know. So okay. now I'm going to call him Tom, because Tom. he is Tom. at that level Ooh. now. <laughs> My guy's ready. That's what I would say. I, I, we've been talking about working together for a while. I'm glad I finally have the right 
project and the right platform. And, yes. and that's my philosophy on finding talent, mm -hmm. is that it's a particular skill set for a particular time, right. for a particular mm -hmm. platform. Right. And I think this is his time. Now, what I did really you do. find out about him that you didn't know? He got the best hats and sweaters <laughs> I have ever seen. The sweater hat game strong. The sweater strong. hat and the sneaker game is strong. <laughs> that hat game is pretty serious. Yeah. But no, seriously, he is, um, man, Will is humble. Mm -hmm. You know, for all the accolades you guys just ran off, you know, this brother is still down to earth. Uh, Will will show up on the set, give you some pointers. He's, he's, he's in his jeans, he's in his sneakers. He's still got his, you know, his, his sleeves pulled up mm -hmm. and he's ready to go to work with you. And for someone that's done everything he's done, you don't even really expect that. Mm -hmm. I don't even expect to see him come around, mm -hmm. you know, but for him to come and, and, and um, sit in with us and, yo, town, do this, I, I love it. He's, all, he's right there with me. Well, we are glad that you all are sitting in with us. We do. And if you are continuing on with us with the full hour of Sister Circle, we will be continuing with Will Packer and nephew Tom. And as always, the conversation continues on Sister Circle TV. We're back with Will Power Packer and Nephew Tommy. Now, guys, as we talked about earlier, you're both happily married men. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay? Yes. So we're about to play a game. Yeah. Okay. Uh-oh. See how much you guys know about being happily yeah. married black oh, men. Let me get the material. Let me sure. get them. If oh, you're happy boy. and you know it, yes. have a little smiley hands. face. Yes. Really? But if you're not down for it, do a little, do a little frown. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. I okay. got it. Okay. I got it. I got All it. Right. I got it. I'm, I'm going to ask the first question. Okay. Let's get it popping. Working out with the wife. Yes or no? Absolutely. Oh, he said no. 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 Oh, come on, Tommy. No. <laughs> then what do you mean? No. How do you say no? That's a great thing. Working out with her? Yeah. No, we tried that. What happened? It does, that doesn't work. Why? <laughs> because after 20 minutes, she's ready to go. <laughs> You know, she gonna do about ten uh, minutes of cardio and then she ready to go. That's not a that's not a trip to the gym. She could have walked around the block in the neighborhood. All right, all right. No, I'm not doing that. No. Okay, okay, okay. Well, um, there's history there. I see, yeah. How about the husband cooks if the wife cannot? Oh no. Yeah, I could do that. No. Ooh. We're gonna be hungry. No, no. Oh my goodness. No, I cook. That's my pastime. I cook. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, you know what we do? What? Grubhub. That's what we do. Absolutely. <laughs> Postmates. Okay. Uber, Uber Eats. Absolutely. <laughs> so you cook all you want. Show off. Okay. We full over here. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Say somebody cook. Somebody cook. But mm -hmm. the Bible said Hebrews. Uh oh. Oh, really? He, he makes the coffee. Oh, Hebrews. 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 <laughs> 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 okay. Okay. What about getting marriage advice from friends? Mm-mm. 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 What they know? Uh-uh. <laughs> no. Nope. They mean they got divorced before you. Yeah. Yeah. Not listen to them. It ain't none of, none of our friends been together longer than us, so hey. Exactly. Can't tell me nothing. So I'm gonna get, get advice, advice? is gonna be from them. All right, all right. They, 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 got, the, they got the stat sheet. Yep. They do? Yeah. It's 37, yeah. No, no, Come no, on you, now. You really, you, you, yeah. going, you yeah. get it all going on. Okay, what about the husband manages the finances? Make sure the, make, you make sure the bills get paid. No. Nah. 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 <laughs> that don't make no nah. sense. Let, Zero let, sense. Let her do that. We that are, is we, so yeah. we are making sense. the money. Absolutely. We're making it. Yeah, I agree. Okay. I agree. Okay. My wife is good with money. She can handle it. Yes, we usually are. But don't we let me are. find out about no other accounts, though. <laughs> well, that was coming oh, that, 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 that would have been a good one. That would have been a good one. Okay, one more. One more. Okay. What about sticking to your guns even after the argument is over? <laughs> oh, 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 I'm a standoff. Bad. I stand off. <laughs> uh, we've had a Mexican standoff. <laughs> we got, we've had a we got type A personalities <laughs> over here. Oh yeah. my God. Oh, yeah, yeah. So my wife's said, from Memphis, so you know she never wrong. So it gets, <laughs> it goes down at the crib. So you, so you stand off as well. Uh, well, I, yeah, I do, I do. Mm -hmm. You know, because I'm right. If what I'm about right, to the whole don't go to bed angry whole it concept. It makes it makes the makeup great the next morning, though. Yeah. I tell you that. And we don't go to bed at the same time. We don't go to bed at the same time. Oh my. Okay. So it, with all the the busyness that goes on in y'all life. Is there anything else that you want to do? Is there anything else that you're working on that we should be looking out for? Oh, yeah. Well, me, I got a, uh, I got a new movie coming in February. Okay. Uh, it's called What Men Want. 
And oh, it's that's all the preview on that. That's going to be you too good because I remember the original. The original was with, with the man, with the male yeah. gift. Yeah. With women one, he could hear the thoughts. He of can women. hear the thoughts. Taraji can hear the thoughts in men. Oh, that's so fun. That's going to be so dope. Oh, that's amazing. That's going to be the bomb. I'm going to be right on the front row on that one. Yes. So that's my next movie coming out. Okay. That's amazing. That's going to be awesome. I'm going to be ready to see that. Now, nephew Tommy, what you got going on? You know, beyond doing. Besides these shoes. Besides these shoes. I told you, I got about three more payments on Yeah, because they got it all going on. <laughs> you know, besides doing a lot of stand-up, mm -hmm. you know, I do have a, a, a sitcom that's called um, Life After 40 that I will be pitching to the one and only. Oh, that's a good time. Slid that in, didn't he? Yeah, you slide that in. Slide that in. So you slide like that it. in. You slide it in on TV. Yeah. You do that. That's how you do that. You do that on the couch. Well, what's the premise of that, Life After 40? Oh, my God. Can you see nothing? Can you remember nothing? Yeah. Sex is different. It goes on and on. Yeah, Everything yeah. that goes on after 40. That sounds like that's something true. now. Yeah. I like that. Yeah, see what I'm saying? I'll be tuned in to that point. Well, we will be tuned in to your show on Saturdays at 10 p.m. Ready to Love on OWN. So you guys make sure that you watch it. Thank you, Tommy. Thank you, Will, for everything. We love you guys down to the circle. Yes, we do.